guys and welcome to another edition of Clogging in the Kitchen with the Corgi featuring my Corgi, Rocky James. Today, in honor of the fair in town, the Central States Fair in Rapid City, we're going to make State Fair Cream Puffs. This is off the website tasteofhome.com. Okay, so for this recipe, we're going to need quite a few ingredients. We need one cup of water, a half cup of butter, a fourth tablespoon salt, one cup flour, four eggs, two tablespoons of milk, one egg yolk, two cups heavy whipping cream, oh yeah, and a fourth cup of powdered sugar, and then a half a teaspoon of vanilla. And one corgi to make it extra sweet. So to start out, we're gonna use a large saucepan and bring the water, butter, and salt to a boil over medium heat. Add flour all at once and stir until a smooth ball forms. Then you're gonna remove from the heat, let stand for about five minutes, add eggs in at one time, beating well after each addition. Continue beating until mixture is smooth and shiny. Then you're gonna drop a fourth cups three inches apart onto a greased baking sheet. Combine milk and egg yolk, then you're gonna brush that over the puffs. Bake at 400 degrees for 30 to 35 minutes or until golden brown. Remove to wire racks, which P.S. I don't have, and immediately cut a slit in each to steam. Then in a large bowl, beat cream until it begins to thicken, add sugar and vanilla, beat until almost stiff, split the cream puffs, then you're gonna discard soft dough from inside, fill the cream puffs just before serving, dust with the sugar, and refrigerate your leftovers. We are going to show you a video from a fair my group recently clogged in at the Custer County Fair in Hermosa. My friend Dean filmed it, so here we go. But I will be a nice mommy and let Rocky lick the wire whisk. We'll lick it together. Mmm. We got some on your nose, whiskey. <laughs> oh yeah, geez, you're so oh geez. You get messy now. And voila, our cream puffs are done, and I have to say, they look pretty fabulous. Now, I'm not gonna compete with the fair ladies by any means, because they definitely got me beat. I could probably do this recipe about five times over to perfect it, but it's good enough for me and Rocky. All right, so our cream puffs look pretty yummy, and Rocky, I'm just giving him a little sample. See, just that little guy. He's pretty excited, though. He likes those. Oh, yeah. Oh, you love your cream puffs, because you are a cream puff, Rocky. All right, so thanks again for joining us for this edition of Clogging in the Kitchen with a Corgi. Join us next month because next month will be a back to school recipe. Oh!